it's Ann Hess with Be Fit, and it is week nine, workout number two. If you are feeling anything like me, you're feeling a little bit sore from those heavy duty, brutally wicked weights that we did on Tuesday. So today's workout is called Ab Sanity or Ann Sanity with the abs. We're gonna really hit the abs hard, but also hitting the cardio. Okay, we're going to be doing one minute stations, but some of them are combo of 30 seconds each. So you will need some sort of stopwatch. You can use your phone and we'll be doing some abdominals and some cardio with abdominals. It's going to be fun. So our first exercise in set one is a med ball high knee pull lunge, 30 seconds each side. So it's going to look like this. You're lunging back, doing a high knee pull, just like that, 30 seconds each side, switch legs, 30 seconds. Take your time with it on this side too. You're gonna to be feeling it from the workout on Tuesday. Whoo -hee. I'm feeling it. So 30 seconds each side. Then you're going into one minute of jumping jacks, which we're gonna do 30 seconds of regular jacks and 30 seconds of wacky jacks, which I don't think we've done too many wacky jacks this, this session. So y'all know regular jacks, you're going for 30 seconds. And then wacky jacks you're going right into, which are these wacky jacks. Hooey, acting a little crazy. Be awesome if you're playing music. Just go to the beat. And that's number two on there. And then the last one in set one before we start the abs. One minute of med ball squat swing with a throw. It's going to be a little bit hard for me to demonstrate here because I have a low ceiling. And we're back inside because it's another rainy day. Yuck. So squat swing and you're going to throw it up. My suggestion, if you have space like a cathedral ceiling, your garage, out on your deck, um, do it there so you don't hit the ceiling. But here I have to keep it limited. So squat swing with a throw. And if you are like me having a low ceiling, you can still do it. You just can't throw it high. Control it. And you're going for one minute. Now we're on to the first set of Absanity, which is 30 seconds of plank. You all know plank, we're doing this for 30 seconds. Do, 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 do. 30 seconds of that, flop over. 30 seconds of a med ball sit up. Just like this. 30 seconds of a med ball sit up. Then you're going back into 30 seconds of plank. Just like this, 30 seconds of plank, 30 seconds sit up, clap under, 30 seconds of these. We are kicking the abs today. Then you're back to 30 seconds of plank, which you know by now, and 30 seconds of total body bear hugs where you get to hug yourself, which I love. So just like this, come on up, give yourself a big hug. Oh, I love you. Oh, I love you, Ann Hess. <laughs> I'm a little crazy. Look, I got my dog barking because I'm being so loud. And that's first round of Absanity. Then you have your cardio. Your cardio is... He's going crazy. Five squats, five pulses, run across the room and do... Oops. Ten V-sits and then run back. Okay? We're going to do it five times. So, five squats. One, two, three, four, five pulses. One, two, three, four, five. You're going to run across the room. We're going to do, I think it was 10 V-sits, and then run back and do it five times. If you don't have a place to run across the room, then you're just going to run in place for 10 seconds. 10, 9, all the way to 10 seconds, and then you'll do your V-sits. Yeah, we're kicking those abs today, 10 of them. And then you're back up doing five squats, five pulses, run in place 10 seconds or across the room, 10 V-sits, and we're doing it five times. Hey, it is week nine. It's time to amp it up a little bit, really push ourselves. So after you finish that, that's round one or set one is done. Now we're on to set two, which is one minute burpee with alternating toe touches. So that looks like this. Hopping down into your burpee, touch, touch, burp it back up, and jump, down, toe touch, toe touch, back up, up, 
and we're doing that for a minute. So, say you get tired after three of them. Cut your breath and keep going until that minute is up. Then we have squat kicks, alternating left and right with med ball jacks for three. So, this is pretty easy. Your ball's right here. You're gonna do a squat kick. Squat kick. Pick your ball up. Three med ball jacks. One, two, three. Set it down. Squat kick left. Squat kick right. I'm messing up my left and right. One, two, three. Back to squat kicks. You're doing this for a total of one minute. All right? Then we just have one minute of 30 seconds on each side of med ball wood chop. So you're coming to the outside of your knee, coming up on your tippy toe, reaching as high as you can. 30 seconds on one side, and then 30 seconds on the other side. Then we're back to ab sanity. We have 30 seconds plank, then 30 seconds of rocky sit-ups. You know rocky, right? These are the rocky sit-ups. You can make the sounds too. 30 seconds of rocky sit-ups. Back to 30 seconds of plank. Then we have 30 seconds each, one leg climbers. Like this. 30 seconds on this leg, stay on that same leg for 30 seconds, and then you'll climb up the other leg. Reach all the way to that toe for 30 seconds. All right, then you're back into plank for 30 seconds. And our last one, I believe, is snow angels for 30 seconds. Snow angels are touch your thumbs over your head. You're gonna come up wide and touch your pinkies. So come up wide, touch your pinkies here. Go back, touch your thumbs. And you're going for 30 seconds. All right, then our cardio segment. Okay. Med ball sit-ups, five times, alternated leg pass, 10 seconds run, and 10 thrusters times five. I am killing us today. So here's how it looks. Passing it, one, one till we get to five. Then you're up. You're running across the room or you're jogging in place for 10 seconds. And then you have 10 thrusters. One, two, three, to 10. Then you're back doing your sit-ups five times through. Run in place 10 seconds or run across the room. Do 10 thrusters, come back. And that you're doing five times, my friends. And then you're done with round two. I am sweating already. It's awesome. Now for round three, we have um, one minute of four butt kicks and they're gonna be one, one, two, two, to a jump squat touch. So, looks like this. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, jump squat. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, jump squat. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, jump squat. And you're doing that for a minute. And you can tell I enjoyed that. That's kind of fun. I kept going. You're going for a minute. Then, we have a forward and reverse lunge combo, 30 seconds each leg. If you want to, you can hold on to something. I'll show you what it looks like not holding on. Forward lunge. Oh, I gotta get myself room, sorry. Forward lunge to a reverse lunge. You're going just like this. It helps if you use your arms for that core balance and stability. So 30 seconds on one leg. If you need to, you can hold on. Forward, whoops. Reverse. Barbies are in the way. You can't see them, but there's Barbies there. Okay? So 30 seconds each leg. Forward. Reverse. Ball's in the way now. Limited space. But forward, reverse, 30 seconds each leg. Then we have inchworm push up with a reach and a reach. So standing back here, I'm going to walk it out to my inchworm, do a push up. Reach. I'm gonna add another push up because why not? And reach. And then walk it back, straight legs. And keep going till the minute is up. A lot of these exercises are working those abs on top of the ab sanity section of the workout. So now we're back to the ab sanity section where you're back to 30 seconds of plank. You guys have that. Then you're doing 30 seconds of bicycles, just like this. Oh, what do you need? Pump them out. Keep your feet hovering low, not way up here. You really want to engage those abs. Hover the ground. 
get your shoulder blades as high up as you can and you will feel that then you're back to what 30 seconds of plank on my own and then you have 30 seconds sit up reach right reach left okay so sit up reach right sit up reach left sit up reach right you're doing that for 30 seconds then you're back to plank plank is awesome back to plank and then we're trying something new this is hard for me anyway functional sit up it takes out those hip flexors out of play and you're really forced to use those abs so put the bottom of your feet together take the ball over your head follow it up to here but then leave it go back down pretend you have the ball in your hand come up you'll see much harder without the ball alternating with the ball and without the ball okay doing that for 30 seconds awesome and I am sweating then that's it for that and then we have just cardio one two three laterals which I do like these two throw them in quite a bit one two three laterals with a touch come back and drop so I'm gonna start here and we're gonna do one two three touch and then when you come back it's gonna be a drop one two three drop touch your chest to the floor come back up one two three touch one two three drop touch and you're doing that eight times all right eight times eight rounds through and that completes this workout all right so I think you can get it done probably in like 25 minutes maybe 30 or less if you keep moving there is a little Tabata I threw at the bottom if you're feeling like I feel good I want to keep going so I threw a Tabata set in there where you could do 30 seconds of each thing we're gonna go through two times of med ball squat throw which we've done med ball oblique twist from standing doing this for 30 seconds again we're working those abs 30 seconds of oblique twist and 30 seconds of fast feet and touch the ground so it's one two three four five touch one two three four five touch and it's only those three exercises that's a minute and a half and you're doing it twice for a total of three minutes and that will end the whole workout all in all done week nine workout number two you should be feeling mighty fine I can't help it you can see the endorphins are just flowing off of me this is great so we're heading into week 10 y'all Friday is the last day to register for our Grinch program to get 20% off I hope you'll join us we'll have more fun workouts for over the holidays some good recipe shares good stuff happening on our Facebook page hope to see you for that but definitely see you next week for week 10 have a great weekend bye bye